Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This channel, we do Flutter and app development and generally coding related videos. Today, we are diving into a hot topic in the Flutter community, Flop, a new fork of the Flutter framework. Imagine a future where you can build smaller, faster and more modular Flutter apps. That future is here and it's called Flop. So before starting, before diving into the flow, let's quickly recap what's the hot in Flutter world right now. Cross-platform development, Flutter's ability to build apps for both iOS and Android from a single code base is still a major draw. State management solution, tools like provider, river pod and block are being widely used to manage complex app states. And Perform for performance optimization, techniques like code splitting, lazy loading, and image optimizations are essential for the delivering high performance apps. So now let's back to the topic. What is Flop? Flop is a new fork for the Flutter framework. It aims to address some of the limitations of the official Flutter framework, particularly in terms of modularity and performance. So why was Flock invented? The core idea behind Flock is to create more modular and customizable Flutter framework. This means you can pick and choose the component you need for your app, resulting in a smaller app sizes and better performance. Here are some of the advantages of Flock. Modularity. Break down your app into smaller and independent modules. Performance. Smaller app size can lead to faster app startup times. Customizations. Tailor the framework to your specific needs. And community driven. Flock community is actively developing and improving the framework. Future of Flock and Flutter. So while Flock is still in early stages, it has potential to revolutionize Flutter development. It is important to keep an eye on its progress and consider its benefit for your future projects. As for Flutter, it continues to be powerful and popular framework for building beautiful, high quality and high performance apps. With its strong community and rapid development, Flutter's future looks bright. So that's it for this video. If you are interested in learning more about Flock and encourage you to check out their official documentation and GitHub repository, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel for more Flutter and app development tutorials and let me know in the comments what you think about Flock. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.